you don't want to waste your life because your life is just too short. And the truth is, is God has a plan. God has a plan for you. And the thing is, is when you're ready to really make a move, like, and make a change, like, God has a couple of different options for you. Like, once you're, once you're willing to do the work, and once you're willing to say, you know what, I've, I've had enough of this shit. Like, once, once you're willing to, to get to that point where you're like, I gotta make a change, God is right there, like, waiting for you to, like, take, take a left, take a left, or take a right. He just doesn't want to keep, you know, banging your head into a wall. And the thing is, is like, as long as you're, as long as you're continually, and it doesn't have to just be into porn. It could be, it could be, you could be into anything that you know that you're not supposed to be doing. I mean, somebody could be watching this right now and could be cheating on their girlfriend. Man, I, I haven't thought about that. Like somebody right now could be watching this and could be cheating on their girlfriend and could be like hurting her. And like they could just be sitting here watching this. Wow. I didn't even, I, I haven't even really ever thought about that. Like I could be shooting this video and somebody's like listening to me and, and I, and, and, and I realize that they're like cheating on their girl or it could be a, it could be a guy. It could be a guy cheating on their boyfriend. It's like, come on, it's like, come on, you, it's like, you know, you know, that's not right. You know, that's not right. And you don't, you're not going to feel good about that. You got to make the, you just need to make the decision not to do something like that. Because the truth is, is if you're not happy with your, with your partner, then tell them about it or make a change, but don't, don't go out and hurt somebody. I'll tell you the time, the time I got cheated on, man, it's, and, and the thing is, is, I don't know if people necessarily understand. It, you know, I wonder, I wonder if that's true, that people don't quite understand like how much it just rips your heart out. Holy shit. And the thing is, is I think if more people knew how bad it was, like, I don't think that they would necessarily do it. Because, I mean, I don't, I really don't believe that there's that many, like, bad people in the world but I mean don't don't get me wrong there's some there's 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 a good amount but I just I don't think people do it because it's like because they understand how bad it is you know I, I just think that but it's awful man it's it's a horrible like I mean your stomach is just you, you feel like you just got punched in the head you, you really do I mean I remember I remember I drove out to these woods one time and I just, I just started, I just, I was so upset. I just started yelling into the, into the woods and I just started like screaming. I was so, I was just so gutted from it. I remember too, I, I learned who the guy was that she ha had sex with. And I sent him this, this letter that was basically threatening him. And, uh, later on she ended up calling me and he was going to go to the cops and luckily she she talked him out of that she talked him out of that but uh man that's it's pretty messed up i uh yeah i remember i just i really threatened him really bad cuz i was so i was so angry and so hurt and uh but you, you know what? Like the truth is, is he sh he knew, he knew that she had a boyfriend, and that that was wrong. Like he got he got, what I did was was wrong. What he did was also wrong, you know. So it's like, it's not just one party is at fault. It's like there's no doubt that, like we were both wrong, you know. But the truth is, is like if you know that a girl has a boyfriend, you 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 can't you can't you can't pursue that. Like, you can't pursue it. It's just, it's not right. It's not the right thing to do. My dad was always the one raising me, saying, son, you just, you got to do the right thing. You always do the right thing. It's like an honor code. It, it, it was the Ringler code. It was the Ringler code, and it was like, do the right thing. You know, don't, don't do the wrong thing 
and like go down the wrong path. So just don't waste your life. That's all I'm saying to you. It's like cheating is horrible. It's horrible. It's horrible for you. It's horrible for you. It's horrible for you because you're, you're living a lie. I mean, it's called cheating. I think it's called cheating because you're cheating yourself. You know, like you're, you're literally cheating yourself. All right, I'm out. I got I got some new tea called Bengal Spice. No caffeine, but it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. It's pretty cool.